Plaintiff Officer Peter Chilstrom is suing defendant Richard Gibson for defamation of character. You got a motorist driving along the highway. That's you. Yes. Speeding a little bit. And he's stopped by you, California Highway Patrol. Yes, ma'am. And given a ticket. And then you filed a complaint against him with his employer, California Highway Patrol, because you said he was rude to you. Is That's that correct. about it? That's correct. And now you are suing him for defamation. Yes, ma'am. Tell me about the stop. Yes, ma'am. On the uh, date and time in question, I was working a special enforcement uh, detail dealing with radar. Uh, I observed the defendant's vehicle, Mr. Uh, Chilstrom, uh, driving that vehicle. Uh, he's exceeding the speed limit. I made an enforcement stop on that vehicle. Uh, he exited my patrol car. I contacted Mr. Chilstrom. Uh, this was done in a very professional manner. I, uh, Tell me what you said. Uh, good afternoon, sir. The reason I stopped you is for your speed. Uh, I advised him that uh, I need to see his driver's license registration. I obtained that information. I advised him that the uh, citation was written for 65 miles an hour in a 55 mile an hour zone. It was on radar. Uh, I advised him the court information on the bottom of the citation and I directed him to a place on the citation so that he could sign that. He signed the ticket. I gave him his copy and I returned my patrol car. He left and I left the scene. Now let's hear from you, sir. Yes, Your Honor. Um, I believe his, his explanation is a little sugar-coated. Uh, that's for me to decide. So you tell me what happened. When I uh, w awaited uh, Officer Gibson to approach my vehicle, I uh, was surprised by his pounding on the window, uh, an abrupt pounding, roll down your window in a command. Uh, that is not a greeting to me. I don't recall him asking for my registration because what he did is he reached right into the right-hand corner of the windshield and just ripped it out instead of asking me for it to, to remove it for him. And then a uh, very short dialogue. I, I don't even recall what it was because it was very little. That dialogue, if you don't recall, it couldn't have been offensive. Yes, I, I felt it was offensive because he was being very non-communicative, very, very uh, short, and he did not use a lot of... Uh, uh, words with me. I mean, you weren't going to a party with him, sir. He was giving you a ticket. He needed your license, that. your registration. He needed the information that you were giving him. I don't recall him stating to me that he uh, got me on radar. I had to ask him that, otherwise I wouldn't have asked him that. I mean, I speak the English language and it's obvious that I understood what he was saying to me. And when I asked him that, he acted very uh, defensive about the fact that I asked him about the radar and he says, that's what I told you, sir, in, in a loud uh, manner. Then when he had me sign the citation, he tore it from the, his book and gave it to me, did not, wa did not even uh, bid me a farewell, like, have a good evening, thank you for complying, thank you for cooperating with me, most officers will. Then he walked off and just walked back to his uh, patrol unit. And then what happened? I drove home. I uh, thought about the incident, trying to rationalize what it was that upset him. Well, I couldn't find the answer, so I decided I would call the CHP office. I got a couple of people who answered the phone, who uh, just basically uh, didn't really want to hear me. Um, I got put on hold a lot. I tried to make a personal contact and discuss it with his supervisors, but it, it didn't do him any good. So you filed a complaint? Yes, I wrote a complaint. And in your paper, sir, you have a copy of the tape, and I'd yes. like to hear the tape. Hello, sir, you can roll the window down for me, please? That's good. The reason I stopped is for your speed. You need a license or registration card, please. Can I interrupt? Your current address there in uh, Quartz Hill? Yes. Okay, hold on. All right, sir, I just need your signature there in a red box. Court information is on the bottom of the ticket. And there's radar 65 and 55. Court information is located on the bottom there, and that's out of... Uh... 65? Yes, sir. Okay, on, sir. In the red box, sir. Radar, sir? That's what I said, sir. I didn't hear you the first time, sir. Mm -hmm. Did you copy there? That's the end of the ticket. 